state-owned company Denel has been thrusted in the spotlight on the company's role in the allegations of arms said to have been supplied to Russia. Deputy Minister of Public Enterprises, Obed Babela, with about four months in the portfolio, visited two of the embattled company's plants in Pretoria. Denel has not been productive for about four years now, partly due to rampant corruption. The money that the National Treasurer appropriated uh, in October last year during the medium-term budget policy statement is now beginning to give life for Denel to be the supplier of the army in South Africa and then and also the police on when it comes to weapons and and then ammunition and uh, and also beginning to ensure therefore that capabilities of South Africa are once more intact and so that South Africans can feel safe that their country is well protected because Dinel is back on its feet. Papela says there's no evidence to suggest that the arms manufactured from Dinel plants were traded with Russia, calling for proof. We don't know what the, the, the ambassador of the United States uh, information he has. And the president yesterday said to the nation that a, an inquiry will be entered into where he's going to appoint a retired judge to go and investigate the allegations. But the ambassador should have really used the diplomatic channels. When you are an ambassador in a country and something happens that you as a country are not happy with, you go to the Minister of International Relations, engages with them through the diplomatic channels, and then the minister and counter minister of uh, United States should have then engaged on this with the Secretary of External Affairs to then begin to then find a way of really getting the truth, whether those suspicions are real or not. After years of decline due to state capture and corruption, Denal says it is now starting to see stability. The company aims to rebuild its reputation and capabilities. In terms of uh, the turnaround, and that was part of the cleanup of the company, in terms of uh, governance, to, to, to reinstitute governance in the business, uh, to get a strong board uh, uh, in place, uh, to get uh, a management that, has, uh, that reports to the board with a strong oversight that is there. And then uh, from there, we developed the turnaround plan and that turnaround plan is a uh, part of what we are busy with. It is the basis of the turnaround plan that we, we, uh, uh, National Treasury uh, recapitalized the business uh, to assist with the production activities that we are busy with. Dinal says the company has no knowledge of the alleged arms transaction. I think it's important to also acknowledge that Dinal is not the only manufacturer and uh, that in the we have not uh, in terms of the permits that we have, we have not uh, had export permits for, for Russia, so it would not have come through that. The Directorate of Conventional Arms Control uh, is responsible and they would be the ones that would know uh, which permits were issued. And what I'm saying to you is we have not had permits issued for export to Russia. The Department of Public Enterprises is confident in arms company Denel's turnaround strategy. A government has injected around 4 billion rand to help get the company move to optimum operations with the ministry, saying it now awaits that crucial evidence that will confirm if indeed the ammunition manufactured here now forms part of that Russia-Ukraine war. Katla Walorodi, SABC News, Pretoria.